Well, Bill, of course, Germany really is starting to come to terms with the news of this devastating bus, bus crash, as it does, according to the most recent report, seem that the vast majority of those killed and indeed injured in the crash were German citizens. Um, Portugal's Prime Minister Antonio Costa late last night tweeting out his condolences directly to Angela Merkel in what he said was a difficult time. Angela Merkel's spokesman Stefan Seibert late last night tweeting and I quote devastating news from Madeira. We are in deep grief for all of those who lost their lives in this bus tragedy and our thoughts are with those who have been injured. Uh, end quote. Germany's foreign office uh, also late last night saying that it was deeply saddened by this news and they set up a hotline uh, to provide any family members or anyone involved with any information. Um, and of course, this is something that is on the front pages of all of Germany's newspapers this morning. The Bild newspaper calling this a devastating tragedy. Many newspapers this morning uh, in their headlines running with the quote of uh, the Portuguese president, Sousa, who said that this is a moment of pain. Of course, a moment of pain that is felt in Portugal, but also will be felt very deeply here in Germany. And many German citizens waking up this morning to this devastating news are starting to express their feelings and their condolences on social media. Many people, of course, pointing out that this is a tragedy that happened so close to the Easter holidays, a time that's supposed to be about family coming together and a celebration. So this is a real tragedy. And, of course, many people questioning uh, just how this tragedy happened. How could this bus crash have happened? Of course, this is something that will still need to be investigated. Um, and uh, the, uh, the, the president of Portugal, Sousa, has said that he will be speaking to his German counterpart, Frank Walter Steinmeier today. Of course, the Portuguese and German authorities are going to be working very closely over the coming hours and days um, as this uh, crash, of course, continues to be investigated.